Well, well. I was hoping to save the best for last, Goku. But so be it. Come on! Don't hold back! Give up. I fought as hard as I could, but it's pretty clear there's no way I can beat you. So that's it for me. Anyone. Believe it or not, I don't even want to kill a bad guy like you. Now, my precious little babies, see those seven spectators up there. Kill them all. Oh, and do have fun. <laughs> Keep your guard up! These things are way stronger than they look! Damn it all! I, I'm sorry, guys. I messed up! I didn't think things would end up like this. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Ended already? <laughs> I'm not letting him off that easy. He deserves to feel the same pain he put all his victims through. <laughs> Am I seeing things or did he just puke up 18? You. You. You son of a. Huh? In a few moments, I'll blow myself to bits. <laughs> I might die, but then so will all of you. This planet will explode in a burst of flame. If you lay a finger on me, boom! Bye bye, Earth. No sense in wasting your last few seconds while you got them. <laughs> They've killed us. It's all my fault. I could have finished him, but I didn't. <laughs> I... I know that look. Sorry, I've thought this over, guys. Well, any way you slice it, there's only one way to save Earth. Goodbye, my friends. Uh, goodbye? You're not thinking of... Goku! No! <laughs> You did good today, Gohan. Made me proud. Dad, what are you? Tell your mom I'm sorry. I'm not gonna make it home this time. His, his energy, it's gone without a trace. Okay? Live your lives to the fullest, and I'll see you again when you're dead! 
Bye bye. Here it goes. Uh, are we back at the tournament arena? What's wrong with you? Fatina? Vegeta, tell me it isn't true. You let Bobbity's spell take control of you, didn't you? Because doing something like this would make me fight you. It's true, isn't it? If I hadn't gone to these links, we wouldn't be about to fight. I had one day, one measly day in which to beat you, and I wasn't going to waste it standing around on that ship. That was your reasoning? You killed countless innocents to try and repair your meaningless pride? Meaningless? What do you know of meaningless? I don't give a damn about Majin Buu. All I want is my fight with Kakarot. Here and now, I will emerge as the victor once and for all. There's no reason he ever should have bested me. He and I are both Saiyans. But I was royalty among our people. I was a prince, yet he prevailed. He, he even had the impudence to save my life before. And that is an indignity I cannot bear. Poverty! Move us to some place where there's no one else around! I'll give Vegeta the fight he wants, but not here! <laughs> All right then, guess you can fight somewhere else. <laughs> For you to go this far, you must have wanted to settle the score real badly, huh, Vegeta? Can't lie, I get it. Yeah. This might take longer than I thought. It'll be over soon enough when I kill you! I can sense radical energy back by the others. This Majin Buu creature must be really as powerful as the Supreme Kai was saying. I already told you, the only thing that matters to me is this battle. Everyone else can die for all I care! You're lying. Deep down, I know your soul is still the same, Vegeta. Take this! Fine, let's take care of this boo first. You wouldn't give me your best in this fight if you were too distracted. Vegeta!
Team Majin Blue. Kill this guy first. Right now! Oh, here he is, first time! Come on, big guy! Why is somebody as strong as you taking orders from a shrimp like Bobby? Nobody asked for your opinion. Martin Blue is my loyal servant, and he obeys my every command. If he knows what's good for him. Don't waste our time. Vegeta already tried the golden hair trick, and look what happened to him. Hold on. There's regular old Super Saiyan. Then there's a level beyond Super Saiyan. But further beyond that... Do this already. I'm sorry this took so much longer than the others, but I haven't had as much practice with this one. This is what I call Super Saiyan 3. Dragon Radar and is leaving West City. Goku, I'm sorry, but it's about time we took you back to Otherworld. Right. I understand. <laughs> What's the matter, Goten? Uh... Goten, honey. Do you want to give your dad a hug before he goes? Aw, oh, was that all? You should have said so, son. Bring it in. Goten, you take good care of your mom for me, okay? <laughs> well, that's it, everybody. I'll see you all on the other side. Here, give it here! 
Vegeta, let's do this! Hand it to me, now! Alright! I'm Vegeta, Kakarot together! Yes, that makes me Vegeta! And this, get ready for this! Is Super Vegito! No, no! If you really want to dole out some damage, watch and learn! The impossible! If you really want to dole out some damage, watch and learn! Let's end this! Let's do this! Damn you! Damn you both! What? Not winning as easily as you thought! Don't be such a baby about it! If it means anything, even I'm surprised at how easily I'm kicking your face in! But here! No, that was close! I've had just about enough fun for one day. So I'm going to give you ten seconds to say your prayers before I wrap this up. This is bullcrap! How do you like this? Alright, let's hope this plan's crazy enough to work. This drink is truly amazing. You've always been like this, ever since the day I first met you. You were prepared to meet a challenge, even when it was bigger than you were. First, I thought it was your loved ones. That it was your blind instinct to protect them that spurred you on, pushed you beyond your limits. And certainly that was part of it. But over the years, I realized there was more. Something else in the way you approach a battle. I used to fight for the sheer pleasure of it, sparing no one. I killed the dark ones to feed my insatiable pride. But you never fight to kill, or even to win, only to test your limits and become the strongest you could possibly be. You showed mercy to everyone. As if you knew one day I would possess the tiniest sliver of the soul. And here I am, fighting alongside you. By all logic, by some miracle, the compassion has rubbed off on me, yet I still don't fully understand how to do it. Kakarot, you can finish him off on your own! Just charge your energy all the way and vaporize this monster! Uh, what do you think I've been trying to do? I just haven't had a chance to concentrate. I can't focus my power! It's just so hard when he keeps coming at me! I only need a minute! One minute, that's all! Fine, then I'll make my stand against him for the next minute. And while he's occupied, you power up!
Hey, Supreme Kai is in Dende! Do you hear me up there? If you can, then say something, damn it! Vegeta! I think it's about time we let the people of Earth shoulder the burden for once. The plan is underway. It's time for you to create a spirit bomb. But even if I collect a little energy from all the people who are brought back, it still won't be enough to take down Boo. It won't just be a little bit. You'll get every ounce of spirit energy they can spare. <laughs> you really want to use the spirit bomb, Vegeta? Since I caught it so, I kind of feel like a proud dad. Okay, guys, it's all set. And you can speak not to just Earthlings, but the whole universe if you want. That's more like it. Citizens of planet Earth, can you hear me? I like this new side of you, Vegeta. Nice going. Here we go. People of Earth, give me your energy. We need you. It, it's ready. Go! You're an incredible warrior, Boo. It was you against the universe. You nearly won. I hope you can come back once more, but good. I want to fight you again, one on one, without all the loss. I'll be right there waiting for you, only stronger. Later. You mean you can stay now? We can all be together like a real family? You and Gohan and Goten are back and there's no catch? That's right! I can't wait to get to Mount Pauzu and have some of your good old home cooking, Chi-Chi. Oh, come on, Chi-Chi, why are you crying? I thought it was good news. 